What up guys, and in this video I'm going to tell you about the best YouTube export settings for your videos in Adobe Premiere. Straight to the point. So here we have is a little project of mine that I'm currently working on is my Skillshare course. Link is in the description. But I often get questions like, what's the best export settings for Adobe Premiere? So if you don't know, you press I, and then you go to the end of your sequence, and then you press O. And now you have your media that is selected. You go to File, Export, Media. You will see this Export Setting dialog box pop up. And then you want to go to Uncheck Match Sequence Settings. You want to make sure Format is not whether that's Windows Media, MPEG, you want to get away from that. It's You want to click H.264. That is the movie standard across all boards. Match source, high bitrate. Make sure export video and audio is checked. And you also want to go in here and figure out, is that the right video that you selected? And here is the important part, the summary. So you want to look at your actual source of your video, which is here, 1920, 1080, 24 frames per second, progressive. And you also want to make sure the output, wherever you decide to render this video, is also 1920, 1080, 24 frames per second, and progressive. That is important that it matches up. These other tabs don't really matter. The only one you want to look at is video. You scroll this down, and you want it, your important part is bitrate settings. Right now, it's at VBR one pass, so Adobe Premiere would scan through the video and go through it once, hence one pass. You can essentially just click export, and that would be your best YouTube settings for any video render. If you want to be fancy, you can go to VBR two pass, and I usually do these for my client videos, and I usually have a target bitrate of 19, and a maximum bitrate of 25 and I also click use maximum render quality I can export and that is only for my clients but if this is a YouTube video I would just go one pass hit 10 uncheck maximum render quality click export and that is the best and fastest render export things that I use for all my YouTube videos. My name is Peter. You're watching Broke Vision Collective and that's how I render my videos for YouTube. We all start with nothing, but you can always create something. Cheers. <laughs>